Bell Sessions of Focus Wales. <laughs> weekend we don't even know we're just gonna watch some great music discover some new artists and talk to some people who are really making moves in the Welsh music industry starting with one of my favorites Red Telephone this is normal life Can you introduce yourself to us, guys? Yeah, I'm Kieran. I play uh, guitar and synth in the band. Declan, I sing. Cool. Uh, we saw you play yesterday at the Parish. It was really good. How do you think that went for you? Were you happy with your performance? Yeah, first gig back since the pandemic. It was interesting because we just sort of brought in a lot of synths, which yeah. before the pandemic, before we started making this new album, we were probably leaning more on the guitars, so we kind of had to reshift the dynamics a bit, so it was a good sort of test of seeing how we could put it into practice live. Hello, it's Thursday night, we're at Focus Wales and I'm joined with Emily Magpie. We've just watched them play at the Royal Oak. Can you all introduce yourself guys? Hi, I am Emily Magpie. <laughs> I'm Kieran Magpie. <laughs> I'm Max Magpie. <laughs> <laughs> the Magpie family, if you will. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Twins! <laughs> <laughs> okay, so how would you describe your sound to people who haven't heard you before? Um, it's like a lot of extremes all together, like beautiful reverbiness and then some horrible harsh noise to <laughs> balance things out. It's all about yin and yang. Yeah. Kind of like the Pixies, but you know, dreamier. Okay. It's, it's uh, like, also not. No, it's not at all. <laughs> <laughs> It's like dream pop, dream pop or alt pop, lots of ethereal stuff, but yeah, some like gnarliness underneath. And that's basically what you said. <laughs> I always love it when <laughs> I always love it when people describe their own music as horrible. It's one of my favourite things. Um, how do festivals like Focus Wales like? How, what do they mean to you? It's just a fucking great way to meet people, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, it's like, good to like meet new people and kind of network and speak yeah. to other bands and get free food and free yeah, beers. That's really Very important. importantly, <laughs> free food and free beer. <laughs> yeah. Thank you. It's a rainy day today. Mm -hmm. Doing doing great. I've taken it very easy and yeah. I'm ready to have another long night. So <laughs> ready for another set this evening. Yes, so you've actually played a couple of times already. Yeah. Where have you played and how did it go? Uh, I played at Tea Pub, the Royal Oak, Fat Boar, and something else. Okay. They had me play a lot. Yeah. Which was good. So where are you from? I'm from Edmonton, Canada. So it's West Coast ish. Um, think Rocky Mountains. And uh, yeah, I still live in my hometown and nice. I can travel from there. It works okay. pretty well. It's been like St. Nano on tour in Wrexham. This is yeah. my this is my <laughs> tour in Wrexham. I've played as many shows over the last like two weeks as I have in the past thirty hours. Yeah. I mean and you've got another one to come. Yep. It's just it's just St. Nano on tour. Yes. Cool. told you this but before they decided on far far away they were actually gonna set Shrek in Wrexham and film it here but they decided against it in the end because not enough of like the local community were interested in being extras. It's 
Saturday afternoon, we're here at Focus Wheel, just just outside number seven bar, and I'm chatting to Minty. Uh, look at that dog. And look at that dog. It's lovely, isn't it? I mean, it's just so nice to see Focus Wales happening. It's the 10th year of Focus Wales. It's a big celebration. It's also the most diverse, eclectic Focus Wales that I've ever seen, not just in terms of it being an international showcase and people coming from all over the world to perform here, but within our own country. Yeah. It has been, it is, and you know, behind us now, there's a, a mobile whale showcase going on, put on by uh, being put on by starving artists. Um, I think that um, it really, you know, Wales has turned up here in Wrexham uh, this October, and it's just so amazing to see after being away for such a very long time. Yeah. Mm. So you're kind of known as like a music man in Cardiff. <laughs> um, a lot of people would have followed your gig guide for a long time, and we've you've had news this week that it's it's officially a company, haven't you? After we released the map in 2017, um, I kind of wanted to become a like legitimized business. But I say business, it's not a business, it's just just kind of just in a sense that like you can put your flag in the ground and say I'm here to stay. When you do official. Exactly. When yeah. you're doing it as a hobby or it's deemed as like a hobby thing, it's something that's secondary. And I wanted it to be like my primary focus. It was always my primary focus. Yeah. But I feel like having a community and trust company status shows people that it is the primary focus. Yeah. Saturday afternoon, we've just seen Namasaki play in the Star Cafe at Focus Wales. Uh, hi guys, do you want to introduce yourself to us? Yeah, I'm Tom. <laughs> I'm Jack. James. Ed. Elliot. <laughs> What do, does a festival like Focus Wales, what does it mean to you as a band? Oh, it's great, we love it. I mean, these sort of town festivals, it's always fun. Obviously, we get to sort of wander around and see yeah. other bands and stuff. We saw a lot of people last night, um, which is a lot of fun. We're excited to see more people later. We've got another set later as well. We're playing at the Parish at 5.30, cool. um, which we're very excited about. Yeah, yeah. it should be good. It's great. Wicked. Uh, hello, we're here in Infamity Kuyati's dressing room at Focus Wales. Uh, just having a chat. So, Infamity, do you want to introduce yourself? Tell us a little bit about your music. Yeah, sure. Uh, I'm Infamity Kuyate. Um, I'm from West Africa in Guinea Conakry. Live in Cardiff, Wales now. So, I actually saw you play a set with Griff at Green Man as well. Oh. It was a nice surprise, wasn't it? Expected you to be on stage, and then there you were with the baraphone. Uh, how did that feel to be on stage playing to that many people at Green Man? Oh, such a good. To be honest, that was my first ever big, biggest stage yeah. I've ever played. You know, and it was such a good pleasure to play with Griffiths yeah. and his band to support him it was really good. Wrexham, uh, just outside St Giles' Church, which is one of the venues for Focus Wales, and uh, we can't wait to go bananas for some music tonight. So it is your first time at Focus Wales, like you said, you kind of bought here by Toomey. Yep. Um, what, what, do, what does a festival like this mean to you? Um, a chance to network, a chance to like sort of put myself out a bit more wide it's like to a wider audience these mm -hmm. people don't have a clue who I am so it's always nice to play in a new venue because you, you're a fresh face mm. you're like you're literally a fresh face like and no one's ever heard of my sound Oshin from Thumper. Oshin, can you tell us a little bit about Thumper? Sure. Uh, we play psych, pop. Yeah. Uh, it's two drummers, three guitarists. Um, it's really loud and yeah, it's uh, looking forward to bringing it to Wrexham. Festivals like Focus Wales, what do they mean to you as kind of networking kind of thing? Do you see it as a networking or are you seeing it as just another gig? I try not to think about it too much because, well, you know, otherwise I just get up and I feel like I'm playing to a bunch of suits. But yeah, um, yeah so like, you know, I just let our booking agent and our manager do all the talking and play the gig and then I hide in the back of the pub for the rest <laughs> of the night. But 
Um, no, it's, you know, I, I like it when it's a balanced struck of, because I mean, most people who work in the industry are not just suits, they're at our level, they're big music fans and stuff, yeah. so when you have a combination of people like that and a combination of actual fans and stuff, it's, uh, yeah, it's, it can be a nice experience. Yeah, definitely. Well, thank you very much for chatting to us. I hope you enjoy the festival. We've been here a couple of days and it has been great. So best of luck with the gig tonight. Nice one, thank you. Thank you very much. That's quite a nice shot, Lee. Oh, you've already got it, good. Hello, we're in the Wednesday Arms and we're having a pint with Wint. Uh, introduce yourself, guys. How you doing? My name's James. James. Uh, Ashley. And what, what do you do in the band? Uh, drummer. Drummer? Front man. Front man. James the front man. Okay, cool. <laughs> is this your first time at Focus? Yeah, yeah, it is actually. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We've um, wanted to come for a while, but um, it's happy to be finally here. Even though I got delayed like three times. Yeah. We had our hotel room booked like two years ago. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, it's good, it's good to be here. Well, today. And how are you finding it so far? Um, yeah, pretty good, yeah. I've, I've been here since yesterday, so it's just busy. And then the boys work today, so cool. just seeing a lot of people around and catching as much as we can. Uh, for a lot of people, this festival now is like their first kind of gigs back in terms of playing. You guys have played a couple of gigs before this weekend, yes. haven't you? Yes. So, can you tell us a bit about those, how they went? Our first gig back was the Globe in Cardiff, mm -hmm. um, supporting Himalayas, and that was a sellout at full capacity. So, as far as yeah. return gigs go, it was pretty fun to do. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, it was pretty good then. Wicked. We're here outside the Wednesday Arms and I'm joined by Jen. Hello. Do you want to introduce yourself guys? Yeah. I'm Leah from Jen. And I'm Leona. Cool, and um, what are your roles in the band? So I play bass. Cool. And I'm the vocalist. Oh, we've got the esteemed vocalist. We've got them. Okay. You're playing tonight. Where are you playing? And can you tell us anything about your set? Anything that people can look forward to? Yeah, um, we're playing. We're playing somewhere here. Yeah. Something like that. It's set though. Yeah. And we'll be playing some um, of the obviously stuff from Liminal um, yeah. the EP that we released um, earlier this year. Yeah. And yeah, we're gonna play a slowish song just for you yeah. to. We've and definitely get excited like. About us as well. We've, I feel like we've finessed the live set as well to add some like bonus bits to streamline song That's excellent. transitions. Excellent yeah. to know that you finessed the set. Finessed. <laughs> We're joined with Angel Hotel, old time guests of Seatbelt Sessions, <laughs> and they've just played uh, the Star Cafe, and it was very good. Uh, so we've got new member Barney as well on the keytar. Hi there. Uh, <laughs> Karis, <laughs> Sean, and Jordan. Uh, how are you guys? Really good. Yeah, yeah, really yeah. good. Yeah, just had a really nice show. Yeah, yeah. So yeah. We spent really, two, really enjoyable. two yeah. days up here. Yeah. Seen all the bands and stuff. Yeah, it's amazing. Yeah, it's great to be here. A bit embarrassing. Had a few drinks last night. Saw Sean and Harris after Panic Track and did tell them that Key Largo is my favourite song of all time. Yeah. <laughs> it's a ba it's a banger. <laughs> it's hit. Yeah, it's yeah. an absolute <laughs> it's an absolute banger. <laughs> okay. Uh, any highlights of the weekend for you guys in terms of who you've seen? Ooh, I don't think it. There've been so many. Honestly, we. Saw so, um, Bug Club. Bug Club earlier on were amazing. Okay. So, yeah. Really class, really yeah. good. Uh, we saw like Panic Shack as well. Panic which Shack, always yeah. very good. Very good girls. Very yeah. good. Awesome. Sarah Jane Scouting was really good as yeah. well. A Canadian singer songwriter. Yeah. That was lots of fun. I'm just trying to think now. I've seen so much music in the yeah. last like, 20 really years. <laughs> Dan Bettridge really as well. Dan, Dan Bettridge, yeah. really beautiful, beautiful. Got any gigs coming out that we can look forward to? Yeah, we're playing with Ski Lift in the Moon Club on the 2nd of November. Cool. Yeah, so that, that one should be cool. Yeah, we, we love Ski Lift, so yeah. like, it's buzzing to be on the line. Yeah, yeah. wicked, okay. Sure. Well, I look forward to it. It's been class talking to you. Really good seeing you live again. Yeah. Wicked, cheers, guys. See you. Thank you.